Woods Forest to the Gulf Stream waters. This land was made for you and me. Sheila Tower is 74 years old and a breast cancer survivor. She has come to Washington, D.C. to let members of Congress know she does not want cuts to the very health care that saved her life. I am here, I really do believe, cancer-free today because of, of the doctors and the nurses that Health Care Partners IPA has helped provide for me. Her 84-year-old husband, Arthur, is still working in his CPA practice despite having Parkinson's disease. He, too, is a survivor. At age 19, he fought on the beaches of Normandy on D-Day and is now fighting to keep his health care coverage. I don't expect any special treatment from the government. We, we owe a great debt to all the seniors, and in particular, I would say, to the seniors that have seen combat, that have defended this country. These are not the people you should be hitting on. The Towers are enrolled in Healthcare Partners IPA in New York, and along with Dr. John Gastrite, Senior Medical Director, and RN Patrice Theobald, Priority Care Case Manager, spent the day walking the halls of Congress, from the House to the Senate, meeting with their key New York representatives, letting them know cuts should not be made to Medicare Advantage. I want them to know that Medicare Advantage is part of my life, that this is something that should not be fooled around with. There are other ways of doing what they want to do without taking this away from seniors. In the meeting with Congressman Gary Ackerman, the Towers explained they are members of Medicare Advantage, a supplement of traditional Medicare implemented by Healthcare Partners IPA. And the quality of this care has kept them healthier and out of the hospital. 10 million seniors are enrolled in Medicare Advantage. Thanks, thanks for listening to us. I appreciate it. Sure thing. Thank you so much. Sure thing. You take care of yourself. We'll see you with we'll see you and with Congresswoman Carolyn McCarthy, herself a nurse, the Towers reinforced the critical difference that priority care case managers, along with Medicare Advantage, make in surviving a disease like breast cancer. If I have a question or I'm in <clears throat> doubt about something, I just pick up the phone and call him. She tells me that if I'm too sick to get out, I can have a doctor come to my house. There's a nurse on call 24-7. How could this be so bad? Go for it. All right. <laughs> Enjoy your time on the hill again. Right over here, Spirit and Justice. Good morning. Healthcare Partners IPA morning, represents partner. the cutting edge of managed, accountable, coordinated, patient doctor centric, cost effective healthcare, offering patients a comprehensive range of medical care in convenient locations. We work with physicians and health plans to facilitate the care that the patients receive. Hey Mary, how are you? Hi, okay, Dr. Sussman, how are you? Good, how are you? Good, okay, all right. I don't know if it's These doctors, there, medical groups, anything. care managers, and hospitals form an integrated system that is a successful working business model, maintaining quality health care while containing costs. The focus is the patient first. I want you to come back in a few weeks and we check your blood pressure, okay? Watch your salt. What does this patient, this individual patient, what is it that they need to manage their health care? Do they need a nurse to come in every other day? Do they need a special bed? Do they need to be part of a wound care program? What does this individual patient need to manage their health care? Hi, Mr. Moore. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Nice to see you. Pleasure. Healthcare Partners IPA puts a personal touch on individual care case management with coordinators like Linda Cervelli. Whenever he needs to reach out to me for something that is coming up for him, either it's a doctor's appointment or he needs a, a referral to a specialist, I also help him with some of his durable medical equipment. I needed a, an adjustable bed. And uh, everyone told me, oh, they won't give you a bed unless you have a heart condition. So when I called and talked to Linda, she was able to arrange to get the bed for me. That transitional smooth movement from bed to chair made a difference because the bed raised up or, le or lowered. So without that transition, it would put more damage trying to maneuver myself up or down. I have somebody to contact that takes excellent care of me. and. Uh, 
I, I can't say any more. I mean, Linda has, she's my angel. <laughs> That's all I can say. She's wonderful. And Healthcare Partners IPA has developed a unique senior ambassador program within the five boroughs of New York. Ambassadors get paid to input their professional skills working for Healthcare Partners IPA. I'm calling to find out if you received the invitation we had sent. I like the ambassador program. It's the socialization. You meet other people of your age and we exchange ideas. As far as aging goes, it has decreased the aging process rather than increased it. Because um, I have to get up in the morning and I have to make sure I'm properly cared for and uh, to, to you know, present myself. It is a continuation of my nursing career because I'm still working with people. That's which I love and what I do. The flu shots, our other medical blood pressure taking, nutrition if that's needed. The ambassadors also help put together large community outreach events. With the registration, yes. setting up, handing out those prizes, registration, is, uh, doing the whole bag assembly, yeah. um, it really plays such a critical part of pulling off that event. I enjoy going out in the field and meeting different people. You know, we go to different places, we get all the equipment put together. We get to meet people, greet them, ask them pertinent questions. It's one-on-one. Um, -on -one. A night to celebrate community heroes, co-sponsored by Councilman Larry Seabrook, brought out 700 seniors from Co-op City in the Bronx. We work with the community leaders and organizations to provide health and wellness as well as social activities for our members and the community at large. What better way for people to make a decision as to who they want to provide health care when they have a relationship and an understanding and people that care about them and that they're not just a number but they're actually a part of a community. It's a family. So this is a tremendous opportunity for them to build a relationship and I'm willing to work with them 100%. I do enjoy it. I like to meet the people, be with them, and I have fun. The ambassador program seems to fit the bill. I find it very fulfilling. And uh, overall, I have uh, a very good time.